when we got that phone call on the way to the scene that night my body went through all type of changes I couldn't breathe my chest felt like it was caving in my pupils were shutting to the point where I didn't even know what was going on I told my husband I'm like I don't know what's wrong I literally felt like I was dying have a child taken away from you so suddenly for no reason pain overrides the memories every day was a life every single day and just to say goodbye to that too soon not ready you know it's hard for me to sit here and express my feelings of all the good memories when right now the bad memories of how this happened is overriding the good memories. It is hard getting up in the morning but I have to do it because I have another child to take care of. Knowing that I can never speak to him again and see his face or hear his voice and just hurt walking up the path to school walking to the same grounds that he did it just hurts. I was uh, like 16 and he was two and I was playing basketball in high school and he would come to every single game and he followed me all over and then the game would start and he'd run out on the court every time, every time in the middle of anything, just run out on the court, they stopped the game, and pull him off the court. And when he was born, my arms are the first arm that held him. Not his mother, but mine. So it's almost like he was my son as well as my grandson. He was a beautiful child. I still can't believe it. Actually, I, I know it has, but in due time, in my time those memories will come back to me.